Lenny Kelly with us here in the John Mandola Show. Man, these uh, these years go by quickly. Um, you guys were, were struggling earlier. You were a part of a, a young class at Dallas that you guys took took some lumps and you started to build sophomore, junior, now senior season. Talk about uh, what this journey has meant to you as far as just kind of fighting through a lot and, and now here it is, your senior season. It, it was huge. It, it definitely, from the guys who started here at, as freshmen, it, it made us stronger because we, we've been hit with it all. It was, we just learned how to build off something that you, 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 nobody wants to be part of. Uh, but it's, it really builds a lot of character for all of us and it showed us how we just have to keep fighting like the day you got to figure out what you're going to do today to make tomorrow different like how, how you're going to achieve certain goals it's basically all it's a big group of this senior class uh, what are the relationships like uh, we're a pretty strong group we stick together we we get on get on each other when we need to and relax when we we're able to it's all about having fun we've been playing since mini football a lot of us together it, that, that's definitely helped us get to where we are. A couple guys battling through injuries and now you're hoping to get them back for this season. Talk about trying to be a good teammate. What's it like to try to support those guys and keep them positive? You just got to be right next to them the whole entire time. They're working hard. You just got to keep keep pushing them to get them stronger, get them back out there, help them with whatever they need help with. Let's talk about your offseason. Uh, we, we spoke to you during wrestling season, had some success there. Uh, what was it like once wrestling season was over? Uh, in a way, it was it was nice to get back here and be with all the guys together. Uh, really, got it was nice to be able to hit the weights a lot harder, not being rushed with certain things, and just being able to take everything in. On the field, let's talk about the type of football player you hope to be in 2019. What are what are little things that coach said? Hey, I need you to work on this and this. I mean, obviously you've had success on the field, but uh, what did you feel or, or coach feel that you needed to kind of get a little better at? Uh, just hitting holes certainly. Uh, not not hitting so many, going out as much. You just gotta where the play is designed to run. That's where it's supposed to go. So you gotta find that find that hole and just trust trust the process. Let's talk about some of the skill guys on this team. Who are who are the weapons that other guys that, that we can get involved? The running game, the passing game, the throwing game. Our, our passing game is pretty solid. I feel like uh, we got guys out there on the perimeter who can make plays certainly. Uh, Starbucks coming back is looking pretty good, so I think we're in for a lot of good passion. Let's talk about the, the physicality uh, of this Dallas team this year. How physical you think the, the weight room to the field is going to transfer? Uh, the, I, I think especially, it, you can see how it picked up the past past couple years, uh, just getting in here doing the weight room stuff. and I, I feel like this year is going to have a big big effect. I feel like we're going to be a lot more physical. Uh, we saw how we weren't that physical last year so as far as the spots of the season. Uh, I really hope. I, I think I, I know we could get a lot more physical and I think it's going to pay off. Coach Benalto, let's talk about what he tries to bring out in you guys. Uh, obviously you have a different coach. You know, Mike Richards of wrestling and, and Coach Benello. Um, different mindsets, uh, you know, same, they want to go go after it and, and get the best out of you, but every coach has their own little style, yeah. so Coach Manello's style. Uh, coach, you know, it's just, like I said before, what, what you can do today to make tomorrow tomorrow easier, you got to focus on, focus on today before you can be thinking towards any certain parts of the season you want to be focused on one week at a time. Uh, you just got to gotta get the work done first, though. And uh, let's talk uh, briefly about your, your family and getting out to support you and, and what they do, whether it's at home or, or maybe coming out at home. Yeah, the uh, family's always here, sitting, say, sitting in the same group since I was a freshman, same spot at the bleachers, every single one of them. I have three siblings, two sisters and a brother. They're always at every game. My parents are at every game, my aunts, my uncles. Uh, just all of them. They've always been pushing me since I was a young kid. Dad's always been on me. Like, if you want to do something, like you got to go after and get it. We're about six months since we spoke to you last during wrestling season. Talk about the maturity. It goes by so quickly as you mature through high school. And in six months, your, your mindset could change a lot. Oh, yeah. Are you thinking now what that future could hold college-wise, military, workforce? Are you thinking a little more about that? Yeah, thinking, uh, kind of focusing a little more on the military side. But, I mean, college would be pretty sweet to go after. Well, we're sure uh, you'll be successful. Whatever you do, Lenny, we wish you a very healthy and happy 2019 football season. Thank you.